Hello guys, welcome to another edition of our lesson video in TLE 6, ICT and Entrepreneurship. Today's topic is using the advanced features of a slide presentation tool. The objective, define multimedia presentation. Multimedia Presentation Software Multimedia Presentation Software is a tool that does not simply use pictures, sounds, and text, but also uses the following helpful elements that will convey messages. A multimedia presentation tool includes video or movie clip, animation, sound, can be a voiceover, a background music or sound clips and navigation structure multimedia presentation a multimedia presentation is an effective tool used in different fields such as business and education it allows faster and easier grasping of ideas and concepts A multimedia presentation can be easily created and edited using Microsoft PowerPoint. You can add the following videos, soundtracks, and animation to it. Individual video clips can be dragged and set into presentation. Animations can also be added to a specific slide. Sound clips, videos, or even still pictures can be used to enhance the presentation. If you are going to use slide presentations or movie makers, here are some useful tips to follow. First one is background color should be dark such as black or navy blue. Font color should be in contrast with dark background such as white. Font size should be around 32 to make it readable to a large audience. Recommended font type is sans serif. Do not crowd your slide with too many text and graphics. 25 words is the standard maximum to follow. Original graphics and illustrations are more effective, especially if you are establishing a brand. If you intend to use some color combinations, consult the color wheel. Just present ideas on bulleted forms. How to add music to slides? Adding music tracks, voiceovers, or sound effects to a PowerPoint presentation will make the presentation interesting and enjoyable. Here are the steps to follow when adding them. First, Choose the slide where you want the music to appear. From the menu, click the Insert tab, then go to Media Clips. Second, click the sound button, then select the sound from file when you click the downward arrow below the sound button. Browse in the dialog box to choose the music file, then click insert.
third, answer the dialog box asking the way you want your sound to be played in your slides. Once done, the sound icon will appear in your slide. Fourth, reposition the sound icon that will appear in your slide. Fifth, to adjust playback options, click the sound icon. You may customize the options that will appear in the options tab. video clips from file. Audio and video are really great tools to make any presentation interesting and exciting. Here are the procedures. Choose the slide that you want to use. Click insert tab from the menu bar, then go media clips. Choose the video button. Click on the small downward arrow below the video button. Several options will be present, but simply choose the video on my PC. Find the file that you want to insert. Click on the file and click on the insert button. Once done, you may adjust the size of the video. Modify the playback options of the video, click it once. You may customize the options that will appear in the menu bar of the options tab. to put animation to slides. First, click on the image, text or text box you would like to animate. 
Choose Animations tab from the menu bar. Choose the type of animation that you prefer. Click Custom Animation for more specific options. You'll choose a defect to see several options found in entrances, exits, embassies, and paths. Further customize the animations used by rearranging its sequence, defining how you want to start it and indicating its duration and font style. Preview the effect by either going to slideshow mode, clicking preview or play button, or pressing the F5 key on your keyboard. How to add hyperlink? You may insert hyperlinks in text or images to connect them to another slide, file, or a website. Here are the steps to follow when adding hyperlinks. Number 1. Choose the text or image you want to have as a link in your slide. Number 2. Highlight it, then right-click on it. Choose the hyperlink option. Choose the options found in the Insert Hyperlink dialog box. Once done, click OK. Four. To confirm the link, see to it that the text becomes colored and is underlined. Then press F5 key to preview the slide and click the hyperlink text. For link images, you may preview it then click the images. Check out by clicking the play button, the upper left. You may also cut, copy, delete pages, capture pages, duplicate, and select all. There is an open source video editor and movie maker that can be downloaded for free. It is called Blender. You can import video clips, cut them, add transitions, add audio and music, and put a title and subtitles. Let's answer. What is a multimedia presentation? How do we enhance presentations? If you are going to create a presentation, what important things should be considered to create an effective presentation? How do we add music, animation, and hyperlinks to slides?
let's remember, it is always better to create your own presentations. Do not copy other people's work because it is considered plagiarism. If you need to borrow other people's ideas, you have to cite them or mention them as the source. Creating your own graphics helps establish your brand. Let's do together. Demonstration on how to create a multimedia presentation. Read demonstration where some students will follow. Reinforcement. Form a group of 8 to 10 members. Discuss and decide on a product that you wish to promote. It can be a health product, skincare product, or any product of your choice. These are the steps. First, divide the work as follows. A. Script writing. B. Photo and video shooting. Number two, decide whether you want to create a slide presentation. Third, make sure to include text, graphics, photos, animation, videos, and audio as you deem necessary. Fourth, present your final output in class.